Phantoms keep it in uh, again and 18 seconds to go that's going to get picked off and there's an opportunity short handed there we go number 36 for the bees Tyler Van Cleef one on none if you like it's quite tenacious there I don't think there's any love lost between the two sides. Good play there by uh, Sousters. Fed in by uh, Chance. Oh, McEwen uh, uh, couldn't get enough on it. And, uh, and in fact, uh, Danny Milton did really well. Score stays nil-nil here in Peterborough. First period, 11 minutes gone. Corey McEwen, Chance. And again, good defensive work. That time, 65, Harvey Stead. Johnny on the spot. Stepanek wheels, turns. Shot, oh, I don't know how Sepanik hasn't scored. Pressure on the B's goal. It's going to, going to be a cagey one, perhaps. We're not going to see a repeat of the game earlier in the season where the B's put eight. Oh, there's a goal! What a lovely little move there. Cross, ice pass through the crease. Sepanik at the back post. So here is the pass whipped in and uh, Stepanik given the freedom of the city of Peterborough. Phantoms take the lead with a minute and 18 seconds of the period. Is that Susters or McEwen with the pass? That's McEwen. You can see him earlier on in the slow-mo. Just holding off, I think it was Painter with one hand. Mog. Whips it in. Oh, that's gone. Top shelf, glove side. It's dollied over Jordan Marr. So the answer, a power play goal. 10 seconds into the... Uh, into the power play so it's passed by Mog we're just going to see if it gets a, a touch on its way in so here's Mog on the blue line traffic in front of traffic in front of Jordan Mar. we think it's come off number 12 that'll be Aidan Doughty we'll give you confirmation of that so no goals for 20 minutes and a couple in uh, in two minutes at the start of the second period after seeing it late shots goal that's a lovely finish that's a uh, I'm going to say, go there's yeah, Zach Milton's shot. Uh, you could see it. We had a great angle on that. I'm sure your camera angle at home will have been right behind Zach Milton, I think it was. So he cuts in. Takes the shot. Cuts in himself. Off the blocker. Oh, and it's off the blocker. I think uh, Marl looked like he was unsighted. Maybe he'd want that one back, Dan. But uh, yeah. good response from the Bees. They drop one at the start of the period. And now lead 2 1. Oh, here we go. Saved. Oh, it's a goal. So the initial save by Jordan Marr. Rebound picked up. If we just see that again on the replay. Whipped him from the blue line. He comes off Marr. Swept one, swept twice. Aiden Doughty with his second goal of the evening. Phantoms took the lead at the start of the period. Trail by two. Uh, uphill battle given what's gone on in the previous 30 minutes. Yeah, absolutely. And the game really has tipped on its head. Bowering inside, bad Bowering just couldn't get the shot. Oh, Danny Milton! Yeah, Danny Milton's head shot back. Oh, and there's a chance. Goal! What a lovely finish from the Bracknell Bees. The goal scorer almost takes a tumble. So the great little move there by uh, Josh Smith. Smith with the move, and then. Uh, And then uh, Tyler Van Cleef with the finish. Peterborough Phantoms one, Bracknell Bees four, and uh, the Phantoms by Danny Milton. And now the Phantoms, Tyler Van Cleef's on, the, on it, and it bounces. Well, there's uh, Bradley Bowering. Chance Phantoms, oh, they had a man over. Oh, and the pass evades Ferrara. Susters now to Stepanek. Norton on the blue line, goes around the back. It'll be Susters who picks it up. In oh! the front and goal, fantastic! Susters around the back, I think Stepanek got the last tap on that. And here we go, so we got Susters there in front of the goal. You see him pick up the puck from around the back. McEwen on one side, and that's it. So, in almost a mirror of the Phantoms' first goal, West to panic, just goes to the unmarked. This time he was marked, but same result. So Phantoms 2, B's 4, and to be honest, that goal is vital.
at Peaceborough. Phil, filling on the face-off. One in the... Oh, it's a goal! Panelik oh. with the goal. Phantoms have bagged the brace in the uh, final period. 3.54 remaining. And uh, Padalek would we'll just get this on the replay. Phantoms win the, uh, well, actually, the Bees win the uh, win the draw. It's, well. Sorry, just watching this a bit closely. Phantoms lose the draw initially. Malnick scoops it off to one side. Padalek comes pushing in from the right-hand side as we're facing. And the puck kind of bounces up. Padalek swats at it. And um, Milton goes to juggle, misses it. And all of a sudden, it's a one-goal game. So James Farrar now taking the puck into the zone. Cross and yes! The equaliser is there. Padalek with another one. I can't believe that happened. But it's almost a replay of the Bees' first goal. We'll just see it quickly here. So Farrar stops, turns, shoots it across. Padalek, I think it actually comes off the shaft of the stick. Almost cross checks the puck out of the air and past Milton. So you can just see it again. There you go. James Farrar stops, almost loses his footing. Goes to shoot and Padalek cross checks in. So, Bracknell Bees call a timeout. Three on three, loads of space out there. And here comes Tyler Van Cleef. Shot saved by Jordan Martin. And do you know what? That looked to me as though it was just held by his arm at the side of his jersey. You know, I enjoy watching him play every time. The chance picked off in front of Jordan Marr by Boudlis. Man over, Soosters deserves a goal tonight. Oh, and the pass to Callum Boudlis. I'm not sure he's not got a nosebleed. He's that far forward. Padalek. They're not going to beat Milton from there, I suspect. Chance. Yes! The overtime winner. Padalek with the hat-trick. The comeback is complete. The Phantoms trail by three on 50 minutes and win it with one minute and two seconds. And they're on the ice celebrating. How nice is it to get a midweek overtime win? I hope you enjoyed that, Phantoms fans. So just going back through the goal there, you can see James Ferrari had the putt, took it in from the side, Padalek got hold of it. It was held down by Milton, Milton just not quite getting hold of it and um, Padalek just lifted it up and over um, Milton's glove side for the goal. So Padalek with his third goal completing a 60, a 23 minute comeback I think really.